This is one of my all-time favorites. Uh, I mean, ev every page has a new favorite, but <coughs> the gold leaf and the freckles. Um, that model, this model Sabina, is Sabine, Sabina. Sabina. So yeah. here's Sabina, I you know, freckles, you know, that, again, in the beauty world, you know, was always, you know, skin unhealthy, but for us, you know, we glorify, and Georgina had all these uh, gold flecks here to glorify, you know, her beauty. For us, you know, every woman is beautiful. It's, uh, you know, every woman is a piece of art as she is. You're beautiful no matter who you are and uh, just find your own identity. So, uh, and Sabina here feeling beautiful. When we photographed Sabina, she said, you know, she said to me, no, no one ever treated me like that in that way that you photographed me with as beautiful like this. So it was very, for her, they always, you know, because she's more, they call her uh, a curvy woman, you know, plus size, they photograph her for a different thing as a curved woman, but nobody treated her for a beautiful, a beauty mm -hmm. campaign or a beauty shoot. Uh, and so for her, it was kind of a first time doing that. And today she's very, very famous. Uh, not thanks to us, but she is, you know, beautiful on her own because she found her own identity. And I think uh, we have a lot of, uh, in the world, a lot of things are changing and it's uh, for good and uh, about empowerment for women. And it's uh, for us, we are feeling that uh, proud of it and being part of it. You know, it's also that, that word, I've said character, right? So one can't ignore her freckles. She's a beautifully freckle-faced girl. Um, as Arez says, typically in the world of beauty, one doesn't really celebrate freckles in any great sense. If they're there, they're touched up, they're camouflaged a little bit, they're dialed down. So our approach was, well, what, what can we do? So let's... I think that any woman with freckles will want this makeup treatment. Yeah. Right? Yeah. <laughs> It, I saw that it's actually it's actually trending now as a, I, I as a look. <laughs> it is. Yeah. It is. How do you golden freckles for summer like yeah. festival sort of? Really? Yeah. Oh, that's great! And yeah. you yeah. you created that. Oh yeah. Yeah, definitely. Oh. <laughs> I hope you're getting residuals for oh. all of those kids We're going to the festivals <laughs> with golden freckles. Should we go on to the next one? We have so many beautiful pictures to look at. I want to make sure this one. Ida. Oh, the color. And that's, you know, and again, this was a collaboration, as you can see, you know, from the stylist, uh, Eta Gudmundo Sudir, that, was, that is not here right now, and Martin. Uh, we all collaborated. It was a teamwork playing, you know, taking scene and outfit, and, and Georgina started painting, drawing from, uh, from the, taking the, her inspiration from the actual uh, the fashion and just uh, pushing and being, you know, creating more artwork uh, rather than, uh, than just a makeup. Georgina, for a design like this, do you sketch this out on paper first, or do you just freeform it on the model? No, I definitely sketch things on face charts beforehand, but it's kind of funny to see the, the original face chart design and then the final result. It, it um, evolves so much on the day, depending on everything, all of the elements of collaboration, so, yeah. Do you use any tools for color matching when you're going off of a palette from a garment, or do you just eyeball that? Just eyeball it, yeah. They're so, they, they look like they're just lifted directly, you know, with some kind of paint matching yeah, tool, I mean, like I, at the I hardware store or something. I have every color you can imagine uh -huh. in my makeup kit, so. Yeah, well, it's, it's, it's beautiful. And somehow, you know, there's definitely, like, homage to clown, but it doesn't look clownish. Right. Yeah, but we wanted to be, you know, so uh, that's all I do. We want to be more fun and not taking it too seriously, you know, and that's really also a big part of gorgiality, what it's all about, just having fun with it and, and pushing. Do you think there will ever be a day where, where women will walk down the street with their makeup like that? Hopefully this? one day, yes. Yeah, in yeah my, I uh, wish. <laughs> <laughs> that would be amazing. I, you should do it first. <laughs> Show us yeah. how it's done. I mean, at parties. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'll do it. <laughs> yeah, David, we'll, uh, we'll put you in Georgina's makeup chair. No. 